Welcome to the Today's Leader Podcast. Building Tomorrow's Best Leaders, Today. Way to go, guys. Way to go. Keep it going. Good job, guys. All right, Paul. All right, John. Let's finish. Let's go. Let's go. Hey there, it's Coach Curl here and welcome to Monday Mentoring on the Today's Leader podcast, building tomorrow's best leaders today. Today, we're going to talk about persistence. So persistence is one of these things that many people subscribe to the fact that we need persistence on our journey of success. And it's 100% true. And it's something that's timeless. And when you think about many of the quotes that we have out there in relation to success, in relation to persistence, you can see that this has been passed down from generation to generation and continues to be so, the importance of persistence. So when you hear quotes like the early bird gets the worm, slow and steady wins the race, you've got if at first you don't succeed, try again. And in my case, it's try, try, try again. And if life gives you lemons, of course, we're all told that we should be making lemonade. Now, the list goes on. Now, the reason there are so many old sayings about persistence, there's two reasons. One, it is an important element in the journey of success. And secondly, it's because in that element of success, a lot of people have trouble with it. A lot of people have trouble with it. A lot of people aren't able to focus in on the persistence and the determination in relation to achieving the success that maybe they should be. And one of the reasons why is because in many cases, we're told to visualize our destination. What does success look like? And I I know I do this with my clients as well. We talk about what is that visualization of what does it look like in five years time? Who are you with? What have you achieved? All of those things that comes with making a really good, strong, solid vision. It's all there. It's it's all part of the process. But the reality is that success happens in the journey. Yes, the vision becomes this motivator to continue to drive us forward. But the success and can I say the enjoyment and satisfaction ultimately comes from the journey. It's about how do we enjoy the journey on our way to success in so many ways because we're not going to hit that ultimate destination unless we undertake the journey. And that's why persistence is so important for each and every one of us out there. It is incredibly important because if we on our journey are going to face challenges, we are going to face obstacles, We are going to face roadblocks. We are going to face wrong people coming into our lives or coming into our career journeys. All of this is par for the course. So if we ultimately want to keep sight on the vision of where we want to be in life, we need to develop the quality of persistence. We need to be determined in achieving that, but ensuring that we enjoy the journey. I talk so often about preparing in advance. So when you're setting off on your journey to success, when you're setting off on your journey to the vision, whatever that may look like for you, start to think about the potential obstacles, the potential roadblocks, and prepare in advance. If you know there's a roadblock coming up with your direct report, your direct leader, prepare for it. How do you map around that? And how can you ultimately succeed in getting through those roadblocks and ultimately hitting the destination of which we're aiming for. Remember, success success is in the journey. The success is in the journey. Hey, I'm Tony. Thanks for tuning in to Monday Mentoring. I will see you all again next week. Bye for now.